Okay, I'm gonna have two videos. Here's a cold startup 2014 Dodge Challenger RT six speed manual straight pipes. When I say straight pipes, we have catalytic converters and that's it, nothing else. Go ahead and start it. up the camera in the car and we're gonna take it for a ride in the car with the windows down car come on by I'm gonna get on it again pretty good but normally I don't drive it quite like that I just want you to hear what it sounds like with aggressive acceleration
road up here. That was full throttle, I'm sorry, full throttle acceleration back there, chirp second gear. That's even with the uh, traction control on. Georgia. Look that up on the map, guys. I know this is a fairly long video, but hopefully the sound quality is good. But I don't hear any drone in the cabin. It sounds really good. It sounds a lot better than it than it did before. I would be way ahead of the game if I would have just went straight pipes from the get-go. This is with a manual transmission. I believe with automatic, you might have some drone because it's going to run around, I don't know, 1,500 RPMs. Well, that's what I'm doing right now in six gear, 1,500 RPMs at a little over 60 miles an hour. Anyway, it's nothing offensive about this exhaust sound at all. No. So I'm very satisfied. It's loud when you want it to be, when you're getting on the gas, and otherwise it's not that loud at all. You know, I hear guys talking about drone, 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 drone. If you're that hypersensitive to the sound of your exhaust, you probably should just leave it stock, in my opinion. Or go buy you a Prius or something like that so you don't have that problem. I mean, that's my honest opinion. I bought a muscle car because I want to hear the sound of the car. I mean, the performance. I like the old school sound, and this, this car sounds great. Looking for a place to turn around. 10 minute video is going to be kind of long.